This video is part of a series that explains how to connect and program components in a distributed low voltage power system. This video will demonstrate how to connect an external time clock contact to the distributed low voltage power system. The second half of the video will explain how the system responds to the time clock signal. To attach the time clock to the system, connect 18 gauge two conductor twisted pair between the time clock's dry contact output and the power module's time clock terminal. This is not a polarity sensitive connection. The external time clock must be programmed so that it closes the contact during business hours and opens the contact after hours. How the power module responds to the time clock will depend on if there are occupancy sensors connected to the system. This portion of the video will discuss system behavior when there are no occupancy sensors connected. In this scenario, when the time clock contact closes and the system enters business hours mode, lighting will turn on automatically to user programmable scene number five. Controlled receptacles will also turn on. Manual wall station and automatic daylight controls will be operational to adjust light levels as needed. When the time clock contact opens and the system enters after hours mode, the lighting will blink warn and begin a five minute off delay. Receptacles will turn off 30 seconds after the lighting. Manual wall station commands from this point forward will begin a one hour countdown timer to ensure that lighting and receptacles are turned off automatically. Daylighting controls will operate if lighting is on and there is adequate natural light in the space. The next portion of the video will discuss system behavior when occupancy sensors are being used. The power module may be configured for different occupancy sensor modes using onboard configuration switches. Some behaviors will be based on the selected mode. When a space is first occupied, the behavior of the system is the same for both during business hours and after hours modes. If the power module is configured for vacancy mode, the occupant must use a wall station to manually turn lighting on. If configured for occupancy mode, lighting will turn on automatically to user programmable scene number six. If configured for partial on mode, lighting will turn on automatically to a 50% light level. In all configured modes, controlled receptacles will turn on. When the space is unoccupied, all configurations operate in the same manner based on the time clock mode. During business hours, if a space becomes unoccupied, lighting will go to user programmable scene number five and receptacles will remain on. After hours, if a space becomes unoccupied, the lighting will turn off and receptacles will follow after a 30 second delay. Manual wall station and automatic daylight controls will be operational to adjust light levels as needed any time of the day.